Hi, uh, let us explore what are the errors that can be uh, encountered and how to resolve them when you have two classes of same name uh, in two different packages. So uh, that, that was also another video where uh, there was name conflict that was happening in a modular Java application. So for that, uh, we will be facing import collide error and there is a separate video. And uh, this video focuses on facing a similar issue, but it in uh, but in the uh, Spring Boot. And the one that I've used for this video is uh, Spring Boot 3.1.5 and Java 17. The first error that one might be facing is, uh, so you have a package called say package one and you have one more package, package two, but you have a class called printer in both the packages. So the bini, both the packages has same uh, class name. So while doing this, and when you will be uh, referring those classes inside your application, uh, when you make the reference to them, you will not be able to uh, import both the things. And if you will try to import them, you will be seeing already uh, defined in single import, uh, single type import. So but if we are doing that, yeah, this is not possible. You won't be able to import two packages uh, having same class name, meaning uh, you can import two packages. That is that is absolutely allowed. But when you have a class of same name uh, that was already imported and next time when you import, you will get a collision. So which, so which in the uh, Spring Boot will be already defined in single type import. So basically this printer is already defined in this because they are almost identical. Uh, maybe the definition might change, but the uh, class name is almost identical. So you might face that error. And the uh, second kind of conflict people are facing when they will uh, have same bean name. Uh, so which will be like annotation specified bean name, uh, printer one for bean class. So basically what I'm saying is you, I have a printer one for the bean class. Uh, which is of packet which is present in the package two is conflicting with the existing meaning i have already used printer one i've used a bean name called printer one and i'm i'm trying to use that printer one for the reference of pack uh, printer present in the package two so this this error will be appearing uh, when uh, you will have your bean name uh, like the annotations that you're using like the the component annotation or your uh, bean annotation that you use when you are trying to use same bean name for two different classes that is being referred. So at that time, you will be encountering this bean conflict, like the definition of same name and the uh, that it is conflicting with the existing. So this is also similar uh, similar to the above one. So in this, this error, it means you are trying to import the same uh, uh, similar class twice. I mean, according to the compiler, maybe they both are different. One is from package one and the other is from package package two and this one is uh, you are trying to refer your bean name to the uh, to the class that is present in package one as printer one and you're also trying to refer the bean uh, bean name for the class that is present in the in the package two also as printer one so that is the conflict that happens here the third one is parameter one of the constructor in the in the service required a bean of package one printer that could not be found. So this will happen when you would have uh, provided fully qualified a name to your the variable that you are referring. You would have re referred to the one and you would have now missed the second one. So what will happen is, so I have print one and I have print two. This was a, what it does is, so this print one, uh, so this variable is referring to the printer present in the package one and this variable refers to the printer present in the package one. But while you are creating a constructor, you probably are referring to the printer present in, present in the package two. So uh, during that time, this collision will happen that your parameter one of the constructor requires the bean type of this. So this is also one of the error that you will encounter while you are, uh, you know, going through this uh, same name uh, conflict, which is like unsatisfied dependency through constructor parameter one, no qualifying a bean of type. So this is for incompatible uh, issue. So, so this will also uh, appear when you are trying to use fully qualified name uh, to both the variables of your uh, constructor and 
but your B names are having different names. So that mismatch will give you this exception. So what we will have to do is uh, what we uh, one of the best way to uh, resolve this will be like uh, most of the time uh, people should not be using same class name but when you have used it because in spring uh, there will be uh, cases where some of the applications are built on on having same same class name but in the different packages uh, so on those cases uh, try to use a fully qualified name to avoid conflict and then try to use any uh, qualifier annotation or any bean name annotation and then um, when you do that you will be uh, you will be able to uh, try to map them like which class a bean is getting referred when you will have multiple classes with similar name when you use those uh, annotations and values for that mapping them will be uh, easier so yeah, the conflict resolution is uh, as simpler as how you will do how we will do it in the java uh, uh, java modeler program like use fully qualified name and then uh, use component scanning with a unique name so i have my uh, application so I have my uh, application Springboard, which is calling the printer service and I'm referring uh, the context variable uh, passing the uh, I'm pa uh, to the get bean method. I'm passing a print service. So let's go to the print service. So what print service is actually doing is. So what it actually does is. It, it is trying to, uh, uh, so it has a constructor that is calling um, printer from the package one and printer from the package two. And I'm trying to print the uh, message from these two, uh, from these two classes. Like I wanted to print uh, using the classes from uh, package one and package two. And I have a method, uh, it, it, it's a simple method here. And uh, let's try to run. And if you see this thing, I have used auto wire annotation and qualifier annotation and both are saying a printer one. Now, let's see what do I mean by this qualifier as printer one and what is this one. So if I'll go to printer here, so package one I have. So this is what I mean. I've, I've used a bean, uh, I've used component bean and I, I'm, I'm ref passing value as printer one, which is fine. It has, so I have a package one and in the package one, I have class printer, and I have it has a b uh, it has a value of printer one, and I have package two. I have component uh, same class name, but maybe this time I can change this uh, value name. So this is print. Let's keep this as printer two. Now let's come here. So this this print one variable refers to the package one. And I've also used a qualifier as printer one, uh, uh, you know, to map the uh, package one here. So here I've used printer one, but since we change the uh, bean value to printer two for, for the package two, so I'm referring it as uh, printer two, and I'm using auto wire. And here, if you will look at this, this, uh, you know, fully qualified name, so I'm directly referring it as quartest. So com dot test package two dot printer uh, because when you will not have this, you will get the import error, the very first error that we are we were looking at. This is definitely referring to this printer package one printer, and let's import com test archive package two. So, so you'll be encountering this error. So meaning that you cannot import same class name twice from different package so in at this place all you have to do is give full qualified name so used full qualified name and then you have your uh, service class constructor referring to them so while you're referring so this is your variable printer class one and here you change it to printer two and make sure you're giving fully qualified name to your class two, which is your print two variable, which, uh, and then you try to refer them. So now when we will run, so the message is coming from package one, which is message from first and pa package two printer, which is message two. So this, this is the, uh, 
you know this is how you try to avoid having name conflict errors uh, the ones that we referred in the slide to, to summarize uh, try to use a fully qualified name and try to use a qualifier with a value so that when you will have multiple references you will be able to do the ambiguity by making the reference uh, using the qualifier properly and that's it thank you